Hi, Dane. I just want to recap. I'm sure you've told your viewers some of the latest, but for people who are seeing this shocking video now, former President Donald Trump says he is okay after getting hit by a bullet. He was rushed off stage. The shooter has been killed, but tragically, one person attending that rally was killed, and at least two people were injured in that crowd as those shots were fired. Trump could be seen reaching for his face and neck, then quickly ducking behind the podium as his Secret Service detail rushed the stage. Several loud bangs continued, the former president appearing to be injured, but still pumping his fist to supporters before he was whisked off the stage. A close-up shot shows blood coming from the former president's ear. A spokesperson for the Trump campaign also weighing in, saying, quote, President Trump thanks law enforcement and first responders for their quick action during this heinous act. He is fine and is being checked out at a local medical facility. Witnesses who were at the rally described the frightening moments when they realized what was happening. Somebody started yelling, hit the ground, hit the ground. And I, when I looked over, then I saw the smoke from the gunfire. Just heard pop, pop, pop right away. You think, well, maybe firecrackers, and you're kind of stunned. And then, and then fire, and then, like, return fire, and then every, get down. So we got down, and we huddled, and we just started praying. President Biden addressing the nation after the shooting, denouncing the violence, and wishing Trump a speedy recovery. The idea that there's political violence or violence in America like this is just unheard of. It's just not appropriate. And we, everybody, everybody must condemn it. Everybody. And one of the latest updates we're hearing now is that the FBI has taken over this investigation. Agents from the Pittsburgh field office are already on scene. We're told that Shooter was on a nearby roof when he fired at the former president and that Shooter was killed by a Secret Service sniper. Now I'll continue to follow the latest developments for you. We're also told a rifle was picked up at that scene. We're hearing from the former president saying he's still planning to go to Milwaukee, saying he'll see everybody there. Dane. Thank you for that update and support.